vlog is back, my people, and we are going to Tokyo for 2019 Premier League. It's gonna be an amazing trip, and I'm so excited to have you guys witness it with me. So let's make it happen. <laughs> But we are here in Japan after a 13 hour flight. We've made it safe and sound. I have no idea where we're going in this airport because everything is in Japanese. But I have a one hour train ride to the hotel. But thanks to Jessica Kwong, best teammate out there, she sent me a detailed map of how to get there. So I'm in for an adventure. Okay, so I need to look for something called the Keisei Line. Oh my goodness, I am butchering that, aren't I? Okay, you guys are in for this uh, um, this trip. <laughs> Let's make it happen. Right, so the most convenient way to travel here is with this uh, terrain pass. I got it last year and I bought it this year and I have to refill it with like with money. So you get to travel, it's really cheap, really easy. And I am here, but thankfully, so far, so good. We are most likely gonna make it. <laughs> One hour later. My people, we have made it to the hotel safe and sound. I'm telling you guys, I went up and down the same stairs for like a good 15 minutes, but I made it. Now it's time to eat and go train. But real talk, my people, it was so hard to get on that train. Listen, I couldn't even fall asleep. It was an hour and a half. I couldn't fall asleep because I was trying to figure out half the time what station I was at and half the time what station I had to get out of. I don't even, I don't know, but I'm here. Thankfully, 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 I'm here. Oh yeah, bam. Did you people know that toilet seats have seat warmers here? So when you're in there, it's nice and warm. And listen up, we are in the room. We made it to the room after going up and down the stairs at the train station a million times. And look what we got here. Master Jessica Kwan got me a Naruto shirt. Boom! You know me, I love that ramen. But look, we are here in the room. I got, I unpacked everything. Now I gotta go. Change because I gotta go buy food, water, water, more water, then go train. It is like three in the morning, I think, in Miami. That's not good, but I have one awake. We're here in Tokyo. Let's get it. Ah! Hello to the vlog. Famous ramen, my people. All right, my people. We are in a ramen box looking thing. Look at this, boom. I shouldn't be talking, but this is pretty cool. We have a little machine here for that. Bam. That water. We ordered that ramen first day here because, you know, ramen life. So, yeah. Good morning, my people. It is the first morning in Tokyo. There is a really loud thing there. So you probably can't hear me well, but hey. Pancakes. Pancakes, I really want pancakes. Then convenience store to get all the groceries. But guys, look at this. It, it's way better in the day than it is at night. Look at that. Boom. Yeah, it's really nice. So, you guys are gonna go eat some pancakes with JJ and I. Look at that divine breakfast. Divine breakfast with a divine. All right, my people. Time to get these hot cakes going. And then start the day with um, some Naruto and a uh, train. My people, we are checked in. We got the credential. Now we just gotta get this sewn on to our gi. You know what it is. We got it all checked in. We're verified. Now it's time to get it on the gi and go train. Let's go. All right, my people. Jessica and I have give our gi. It's gonna get sewed or sewn. Yeah, it's gonna get the, the thing sewn on. And we just have to sit here and wait. And then we could train in peace. And we have the rest of the day to do a bunch of stuff. Right, JJ? Food. Food, oh my goodness. What do you want to eat? Um, more ramen. More ramen. People, we are checked in, everything's sewn on. Training area with the people. My people, training is complete. We go tomorrow. We have Jessica over there working on my back. She's a beast. Right, JJ? Yeah? Listen to my people. We are done with training. That's that. Look over there. Back here. All right. That's what they want to put back in. Who knows 
how long ago. But um, I'll put it on the screen somewhere. Yeah, but here we are. It is beautiful. We had an amazing training. I'm here still trying to get hydrated, but it is so hot, my people. Hot. The training was good. I felt good. I moved good. There are amazing people all around. So, you know, it was good to feed off the energy. And now we're going to go shower so that we can eat and go make some claw machines. So, let's make it happen. Ever in Japan, the best store to go to is 7 Eleven. They have everything. They have waffles, pancakes, a lot of ramen. You know how I love my ramen. Look at this. This is heaven. Most training meal, my people. Look at that. Salted rice balls. You know what it is. Bam. 7 Eleven, uh, best thing in Japan. I love it. Right, JJ? Look at this. We have Mason Stowe here in the busiest crosswalk in the world. He's about to do some crazy stuff. Let's go, Mason. We're gonna get some fluffy pancakes. Look at that bang. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Oof. My people, look at this. Ah. Fuego. Fuego? Fuego. Fuego. My people, listen up. About time is this. This year. Finally got a big one. Look at that. Boom. Flare on for the win with the Firestone. Now, time to try to get a fail. I got a fail on another one, but it's fine. You know, Jessica's the MVP for lending me a quarter. I think that was the. That was the game winner. Okay. The other loss. That's perfect, bro. Tell me that's not perfect. No way. No way. No way. Oh my god! I'm <laughs> f head. Yeah. Camera. Wait. Woohoo! <laughs> oh, guys. Second try. Oh my god. Yes. I got him for his birthday. Look at mine. Oh. oh. Uh, the vlog, happy birthday to Mason. It's in like happy X amount of hours, but in the States it's his birthday, so you know what time it is. Mason stole it over here. This uh, C upside down egg flip case, it is the best. Listen, if it falls, it'll close by itself. I'm not trying to sell you on it, but I'm gonna get it. And we can put this little charm. Let me see, that's a Dragonite, and it has a satchel. You know, once in Japan, you just gotta do it. My people, we are back in the room after an incredible few days in Japan. I am competing tomorrow. I got the draw today and it was a hard draw. It's honestly the hardest draw I've ever had in all my Premier Leagues and all my Series A. Hardest draw, but I'm super excited tomorrow to step up the tatami. I've been feeling very, very well and I just want to do the best possible kata out there. And you know, whatever it is, it is, but I am excited more than I have been in a long time. But yeah, I already have all the clothes down there. Boom, ready for tomorrow. And I have the snacks. Bam. Yeah, I have the snacks ready for tomorrow. And now it's time to watch a good movie. Right there, boom. And relax, because tomorrow is game day. And if you haven't done so already, like the video down below, comment, hashtag, for the vlog, because, you know, support the vlog, right? And yeah. Good night, my people, and I will see you in the morning. Good morning, my beautiful people. It is a great day. About to have some breakfast before the tournament. I compete today. I'm super excited, and yeah, I feel like it's gonna be a good day. I'm gonna give it my all, and yeah, let's make it happen.
my people, we are in the room after an amazing final. Seriously, it's been what, like around three months since there's been a Premier League, so it was great to be back here and experience what I felt before, you know, and like all that adrenaline coming back and competing again in the international tatami with all these high level athletes and then you know realizing ah i really want to keep improving and you know bettering myself so how did it go for me right i finished my first round i did on on and i had a, a really hard pull like every other, everyone else has a hard pull but you know i had a hard pull and i started first which was the first for me i've never experienced going out first in a premier league or a series a so it was a new it was new for me but for some reason i wasn't like nervous and i wasn't worried i was more like excited i really wanted to step onto the tatami and and just perform i was excited to just be back here i was ex i was just grateful to have this opportunity you know and i did on on and i felt really really happy when i finished because i didn't even notice i i i remember i asked jessica and i was like hey um did i rush because halfway through uh, i noticed like i'm like wait what am I doing? Like, I, I just noticed I finished and I'm like, whoa, I, did I forget something? Uh, no, but I, and then I look at my video, I'm like, wow, I'm like, I'm happy with how I moved. I'm happy with how I performed. I passed the first round with, what, 2380. And I saw a score, I was like, whoa, this is kind of low compared to usual. But I was the first one to go out and then I passed. It was Ali in first, Japan, Kinjo in second, Kakiru in third, and then me in fourth, passing to the second round, the quarterfinals. And the quarterfinals, they shuffled the whole division. Like all eight of us were shuffled in random, like randomized, and then boom, go. I didn't know that. So I'd already submitted my second round kata, which was Super Empe. And I performed my Super Empe, I was six to go. I was right after Moto Kasumasa. And um, I did Super Empe, I felt good. I was moving well, you know, but this one, this round felt a little bit different than Anan. This round, I was fully aware of everything I was doing, actually. So, I hope I could, like, in the next few events, kind of do what I did with Anan, where I just lost myself. I didn't know what I was doing. I just was like, wait, what? I finished? I hope I could do that with all my rounds. But, Super Empire, I felt good. I felt like my body was moving well. It was responding. I felt, I felt happy with my performance. I enjoyed myself. I honestly enjoyed myself. It was an amazing arena. And all I'm, I'm just really grateful for this opportunity. I finished in my pool. I believe fifth or sixth below um, Turkey and all the Japanese athletes. And overall, of all the 64 athletes that come here uh, to the Premier League, I finished in 23rd place, which is not bad. Now I gotta keep training. Obviously, I gotta improve. I have so much to improve, so much to correct. I got a few errors I have to, like, you know, maneuver around and fix and all that stuff. And I have many other things that I gotta improve, and I'm super excited to get back home and start training for Chile. Chile's in what, two weeks, I think? Yeah, uh, but this has been by far the most amazing trip I've had all year. Yeah, it's been so much fun. I've had fun with my with my teammate Jessica and everyone else on the team. It's been incredible, honestly. And uh, like I said, I'm just blessed to have this opportunity and share it with all you guys. And if you haven't done so already, like, comment, and share. If you don't know what's comment, comment hashtag for the vlog. You know, just do it. Just support the vlog, my people. If you have any questions, leave them down below. If you have any comments you want to tell me or anything, just leave them down below. And if you haven't done so, follow my Instagram. It's really easy. Ariel Karate one That way you can keep up with all my updates, see what vlogs are coming, when they're coming out, and all that good stuff. And stay tuned for the next vlog. Hope you enjoyed this one. See you guys in Chile. Let's go.